In this campaign I only used tanks to conquer the world, which I thought would be fun. It wasn't! It took me 6 hours and I'm still not finished. I was about to research infantry equipment. We are not gonna need infantry equipment. We will be using medium tanks for pushing. Probably light tanks for holding. Military factories. We have to use the Mifo builds for as long as we have them. And uh, in this game, we definitely need to use them for as long as we can. More than 40,000 infantry equipment in the army. That does sound like we have to have infantry equipment deployed and not just in the stockpiles. Well, I guess we're gonna find out. I guess we're gonna try this. Yeah, Kluger's fine. This is gonna be a little bit improvised today. We can get Haldon now, but I think we're still gonna take Bormann first. Yeah, let's just get Bormann. Let's just start producing a billion panzer divisions. Oh god, first decision that we have to... Okay, never mind, we don't have to take any decisions yet. Because research, we will have to think a little bit here. Dispersed. Right, let's get Funk. And just turn Germany into a giant military factory once we're done here. Shit, we're producing with Henschel? No, 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 no. Not on my Uhr. We're gonna produce with Daimler-Benz. Just pump out tanks, I guess? We do have enough guns, so if we can't Anschluss... Yeah, we can't Anschluss yet. So let's do motorization drive, which allows us to edit the tank division. There we go. Yeah, we can Anschluss now, but I'm still gonna get Cardiac Wagen first. I think I'm actually gonna get rubber processing already. Like our tech tree is gonna be very weird now. We definitely need logistics though. Thing is, we are gonna need a ton of rubber if we want to produce trucks or mechanized or planes and we could cheese the allies early but that defeats the point of the challenge there we go we have austria now honestly i'm gonna get ig farben okay i think the first thing i'm gonna do is we do need to design our holy tanks <laughs> not gonna be able to hold anything. <laughs> Let's worry about the template later. <laughs> Maybe it's gonna solve itself. We generally need to research all of the synthetic stuff here. We could take this, but then Mark always cancels it, so I'm not going to. I'm also gonna continue down here, align Romania and Hungary, and then we're gonna continue with the political tree. Don't need the infantry expert for once, but Guderian, you are very useful today. Just a 10% speed boost on all of our tanks, which is every unit. That seems pretty decent. The light tank we need them to be cheap and they shouldn't fall over by being carved at. Just give me like five minutes I need to think here. Oh, I guess we're gonna try this. The seven production cost is really not that great. God, early fighter designs suck so hard. Still haven't produced a single rubber factory. But we have the Sudetenland now, which we are gonna build in because it's 80%. And then uh, let's get extensive conscription going as well. And in eight days, we will have the medium tank chassis. Let's design the tank. Oh god, I'm too early. I don't have my howitzers yet. I usually just staple them on my medium tanks. Fuck! I guess one thing we can do, we could run the autocannon and then convert the Panzer free ASAP. Right, we're gonna produce a bunch of these tanks and then convert them later. Okay, uh, yeah, I guess these are the medium tanks that we're gonna run with for now. We're gonna see how many of them we can actually get out. Now, I don't wanna just use mechanized for our holy boys, so I guess we're gonna try some 20 widths with as Org? 26 Org for our holding guys. The sets aren't even that insane compared to actual holding infantry. Plus, you know, the production... Co anyway, we're just gonna try this, I guess. Let's drop 10 on the maggot line. And uh, yeah, drop the medium tanks here. You push... I guess we're gonna try this. This might not at all work, but you know, that's what you are here for, to see me fail, I think. And if you would like to see me fail more, you should subscribe. Oh, fuck. My ass. Yay, infantry gets 15 org. Wow, how, yes. Wow, oh god, <laughs> oil is gone. Stalin, surely you want a little bit of oil. I mean, have a little bit of oil to offer me. Auto upgrade this, put you on, and we can't... What? Why can't I convert you? No! <laughs> now we need to fix this <laughs> deficit. Medium flame tanks are still worth it, yeah. Okay, but we need to make them cheap. <laughs> They're not very cheap. And then let's get army innovations. We need to rumble in our high command. Romania would like to join. Yes, amazing. Let's integrate war economies then. The only stockpiles that we're missing are light tanks. So I'm gonna say we are ready for the war. Right, boy. Today, the plan 
is simple. We are gonna invade Poland. Just gonna see how much our tanks can auto push. Oh god, they're already in red. Supply! It's actually messed up, but Poland is giving me a bit of trouble. I mean, I could pr probably still auto the front, but you know. Warsaw has fallen, but serve our trains, which I assumed would happen, considering we have nothing to defend them with. Because for some reason, we had to invest a lot of our IC into something. I'm not sure into what. Yeah, I'll just get a Danish butter. W what happened to the Baltics? I don't remember the Soviet Union being this close to Germany. And uh, you know what? I think the rest of the front, we are just gonna blitz. Yeah, having just tanks is actually pretty good, it seems like. Oh god, no, 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 no. The blitz is stalling. That's the first blitz where the allies are attacking me and pushing me, oh god. The first of many panzer experts. We could call in Italy. They look like they are capable of holding. But also, I don't really want to call in Italy during a blitz. I'm just gonna try invading Newcastle with light tanks. I don't have very high expectations here, let's be honest. We can also get Himmler. Yay, we have mill access from Sweden, which is honestly not useful because we're not the AI. If we were, we could just cheat here. Oh, look at this puppy. You break through once now and the light tanks are just gonna start streaming. Okay, getting a bit cocky here. Oh God, the South Americas are going. I don't even have the DLC. You don't need to ruin the game for me. We actually have to go. I don't want to bother with fighting America. France has fallen. Very good timing because we are about to hit Newcastle. <laughs> I don't have enough command power for force attack. You go here. I moved one of the tanks to a new general, gave them force attack and moved the rest of the tanks to the new general so that all the tanks now have force attack. All orders will be lost. That doesn't really sound too great for me, does it? But we still have force attack on these guys, so this might work. Come on, yes! We made it. We only lost two tank divisions. Jesus fuck, this was way too intense. Honestly, this part is so fun. Just the fact that every single division that we have is incredibly fast. Right, Manzakir Dragomirov. Have you heard of Vladivostok? I hope you have. If not, you will hear now. It's just the convoys getting intercepted. Everything else looks fine. Let's take a quick look at the casualty rates. Yeah. <laughs> what? Italy. What the fuck? God, this is so complicated. We have too many tanks. I'm not sure which design is used for which. We have to deal with the Americans now. There's no way we can break through here. It's just supply and we're not gonna get through the channel with this Navy. Navy, two submarines. Have you ever realized that Friesland looks like an Among Us? I hope you're happy now. Yeah, I think I'm gonna get Niederlande as a Reichskommissar. Yep, there we go. The US is gonna join us now. I guess we're also a little bit behind with Barbarossa, so let's stay historical. And and regret another thing that we do. Kick them out, kick them out. Ah! And uh, Stalin, I hope you're ready. Because I sure as hell am not. US has joined the allies. I'm gonna give up Poland. Oh, naval invasion up here. Okay, Belgium, get in there. I need every single friend that I can get. And I am a little bit regretting not getting Vichy France right now. Three divisions from Belgium. I'm not gonna accept them because they don't really look like tanks. So gotta stay true to the challenge here. I'm gonna be honest, I have no clue how we're supposed to break out here. Just wait until the British are completely drained of manpower, I guess. Something is not right here. If I switch my support artillery away, we lose 425 breakthrough and 370 soft attack. And if we take a look at the combat stats, that's not at all what's happening. The light tanks are holding worse than infantry, but they're at least holding against the Soviets. I'm actually surprised that I've not seen any American divisions just yet. Are they down here? No? I mean, I have no idea what's happening here, but there's no Americans down here at least. I think I'm gonna start removing a few tanks from this front since the Soviets have stopped attacking. Well, maybe he's busy with uh, Norway right now. The British are at least running out of equipment, it seems. Still ramming against us though. Bok, I'm gonna send your tanks down here because I wouldn't mind it if we could yeah, just look at this. This pocket has been cleared up. Okay, Bok, time for Greece, I guess. Save our allies from humiliation. Actually, we only have 6.5% from convoys rated. I expected that to be more. Like, much, much more. That should work. There's no mountain here, so 
I'm gonna keep one tank here. There we go. God, we... I should have brought more tanks. There we go. Look at them reshuffling. Yes. My allies are actually using their brain. Not a big encirclement. Please stop running. Ha ha. I'm prepared. Oh, but Mussolini is not. We have to fix and patch everything that we have right now. We have lost Newcastle. We're also running out of fuel. So many fronts right now. And I have so little units. I can't even grammar anymore. Another naval invasion here. Another one. How fun. Just what I wanted for Christmas. Romania, give oil, please. I'm so tense right now. Oh, Rome has fallen. I feel like I've had easier times with disaster saves. Let's just get it over with service by requirement. Before I forget about it, man. I had never researched cannons. We need cast. We need, we need ca We need oil. We need close economy. How have I killed 400,000 Americans and not even taken 30k damage from them? It's time for some good old capitalism in Romania. Soviets have landed in Britain. It's time for some Wunderwaffen. Extra delegator. It hurts, but it's more important than getting the logistics wizard right now, I think. Oh no, 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 no. We have too many fronts. This is probably how Hitler must have felt. Just a bit differently. At the very least, we can clear up this pocket now. 400,000. All right, get to France. Wait a minute. I think the allies just got cocky here. Yes. Now we don't have divisions to defend the British Isles if we take them, but uh, that's something we're gonna worry about when we get there. <laughs> Why is Bulgaria in the Soviet war? Fuck. Those medium tanks are dead. We, we have to evacuate now. Like the Soviets are just gonna steamroll Bulgaria, most likely. Mussolini has been deposed, but uh, good news. So has Churchill. Yes, yes, yes. Progress, guys. Uh, can we please take London? The Britons, they regret. Okay. UK is out. I'm not gonna defend the Netherlands and the Dutch. They should be able to do that on their own. As well as down here, that I will leave to Italy. Now, we need to deal with this front. We need to deal with this front. Australia. We have run out of light tanks. Oh, God. It's crazy that Norway... Oh, no, that's not Norway. <laughs> I mean, that is Norway, but not the Norway. Our Norway. Ew? What happened here? Why can't I push when I right click? There we go. We actually have to use our brain here. Only three million Soviets. That's so sad. All right. I guess I'm gonna let the tanks auto this because I can't be asked. India? I guess the UK has capped, so the Dominions broke free. Hang on! Hang on! <laughs> What kind of cheese is this? How did the Mexicans get to Baden-Württemberg? Okay, you guys go here. I'm gonna send half of you here. I hope that didn't just break this front. I'm just confused because there's nobody has mill access to Switzerland. And even if they did, how did they get to Switzerland? Please stop sending me divisions. Please stop it. You know what? Uh, I think it's time for a new start. We need more industry. We need fewer Soviets in Germany. We have lost all of Italy again. That's it. Italy is out. Which also means they are at war with the Soviets now. Fall of Berlin! No! Not the Führerbunker! We are retaking Germany. Just sucks for the rest of the world. Ah! Venice! This isn't EO4. Even if we do this, they shouldn't join us. But I'm gonna do it. Give them a bit of gamer support, maybe. I have to cope on something here, okay? <laughs> Have you looked at the game in the past two hours? Probably the slowest World War II that I've done in... Excuse me? Ismet, have you seen the state that the Axis is in? I guess sure, join us, please. Okay, uh, big problem right now. Because I sent so many divisions away, we don't have anyone defending the border anymore. So many allies in the med. Actually, it's not even that many Soviets, so this push might just work. God, that's so pathetic. Okay, I mean, the allies have lost 10 million somehow, but the Soviets and us, we've only lost 10 million combined. I have no idea where all of the Americans went that we killed. Oh, well, where they came from. I guess America. Just gonna see if we can push here. And if so, how much? And how expensive it- <laughs> Pushing seems to be a success. <laughs> Look at this! I think we just overran all of the Soviets here. But it's so expensive! Oh no, wait. We are probably losing a bunch of infantry equipment from occupation. That wasn't that much that we lost in the past- Holy! In the past four months, the Soviets have lost 210,000 infantry equipment and we lost 30k. So we must have overrun so many divisions. Let's build... Is that the cheapest one? Yeah, the Gewehr 98. There we go. Let's just produce 100 a day. All right, Finland, we're here. 
Hope you're ready for the continuation war. One thing we could actually do... <laughs> just fall back. <laughs> Let the Soviets regain their strength. And just repeat this process. Let's fall back to Poland, I guess. France, can you not, please? France challenge to not be cringe. Impossible. Ha ha ha. I get it, it's the meme. That's a pretty good timing, Denmark. But you know what? I don't really care. I need the Danish straight. That is not where I expected you to join, but I'll take it. Rather the African Union than the Allies, I guess. Would love it if we could break here. That would be pretty funny. This is funny. These are very expensive planes, but they will shred. Let's see what this does. Again, no cast here. Just raw power. All right, I'm actually gonna go for an encirclement here. Nice. That's definitely one upside. <laughs> Encirclements have never been easier. Oh my god! That is actually a tank division. I guess we could use it. Or we could not use it. I'm gonna wait a second here. Let them get all of their planning bonuses again. Japan, have you been doing anything? Not really. You've lost China. All right. It is time to bring some doom. And I mean doom. We are gonna start casting. The equipment on the Soviet troops does not look that great, if I do say so myself. Leningrad, please. <laughs> I mean, this is just amazing. You just right-click somewhere and the tanks just move. Come on. Yes. There we go. That's this pocket. Now we need to fight this pocket. After that, I think we're gonna deal with Venice, Italy, and then this pocket. Oh my god, there's so much shit here. Okay, France has been freed. I'm also gonna drop divisions here for defense. Eight planes! You're sucking my efficiency for eight planes! That's why you should never have allies. Congratulations on the encirclement. You fucked up. Yes, that was 1.3 million men. Mild fuck up, if I do say so myself. Hey, if Stalin wants to keep attacking, I'm fine with that. Yep, yep, come on. Just a bit more. Here we go. Any push you do now will make your divisions weaker. Until you bump your conscription law up once and, you know, another 5 million Soviets come out of a hole. Oh, come on. Skoda, let's take it. Yes. Okay, with that we can clean this pocket up. And I'm honestly just gonna order this one. There we go. We have taken Moscow, which is exactly what I wanted. Actually, wait, we can push through Istanbul. I would like to keep up the momentum here. 18 million Soviets. It's that time of the year again. We are running out of trucks. You know what? I will let the AI deal with the stupid islands here. Which might be a mistake, but I have to find an end here. China joined the African Union. No! Wait, Denmark is out of the African Union? Wait, what? Where's Denmark now? Why? How are you in the Allies now? I guess you go back to Poland, please. Which does mean we lose quite a few... Actually, there's not... Even, what? The Soviets moved all of the factories here, huh? Well, I guess we lose destroyed factories. Oh, garrison support from Italy. Garrison support from Turkey. Oh my god, yes! We just got 4 million manpower. Oh, the nukes have started. <laughs> iPhone. No! No! Hirohito! You can't do this to me! The Soviet Union took 8 states? Is communist China? No, at least they're not in a common turn. But that means that 100% of the US will now be focused on Germany. I guess Europe, but let's be honest, it is just Germany. Japan is invading now. Oh god, <laughs> look at the Americans swarm again. Great, now we need a towel. A Zorbi! Hi, building me is here with Zorbies. The most absorbent material you've ever seen. Ah oh, shit, this doesn't work. Let me get something else. Actually, is this singular Zorbi or Zorbies? Never really thought of that. Alright, here we also have our railway guns. Finally, yay. Useful. Stalin, come on. Let's, please, let's just end this. Oh, you are sitting at 17 million and 260 divisions. That's another 30 divisions. Anyway, Soviets, another 1 million dead. Division count has not changed. Come on, I want to do something today. <laughs> I don't want to go to bed tonight and be like, okay, I played one game of 4 No, I don't want you to push like this. I wanted to, you to have the... What the fuck? Why did you move the arrow now? Oh, we were so close to encircling here. If just the arrow didn't get messed up so... Oh, Mussolini! Can you not be incompetent for one minute? Small encirclements, small encirclements. That's all I can afford right now. Hey guys! 40 units. 
All right, I guess I'm gonna leave Greece and go to Greece, else all of these guys might just die from encirclement. No, no! You can't D-Day me, at least not today. Well, this pocket is also gone. There's another million. <laughs> the Americans only have 133 divisions at this point. That is pathetic for the AI. Why have we never designed mountain tanks? You know, tanks that can function in mountains. Uh, that's, that's a pretty big market gap, I think. The one downside is we don't have reinforcements here, but we might be able to do something funky regardless. Just because of the sheer speed of those tanks. Yay, the arrow is gone. Wow, wahoo. Yippee. Let's do it again, please. Stalingrad, Leningrad, and in a minute, Moscow. All of them are ours. And you know what? Let's just attack Moscow. That should work with the air support that we have. That's it. Yes. We don't even have to take out Japan. I'm gonna be honest. I can't be asked anymore. <laughs> I'm hungry. If you don't want me to go hungry, you should watch this video where I played as the Soviet Union without doing a single focus. It was a bit less painful than this.